Hi guys, let's see how to fix this issue where iPhone is keep getting stuck on search screen. So the very first fix is to force restart your phone if this thing happens and your phone is stuck in search screen. So how to do force restart? First you have to press the power, uh, volume up button and then you have to press the volume down button and then you have to press the right side button and keep it pressed until it and the Apple logo appears on the screen. So let's do it. First we'll press the volume up, then volume down and then just press the right side button and keep it pressed. Wait for some time. Do not leave the right side button until the Apple logo appears on the screen. Once the Apple logo appears on the screen, it means yes, it has appeared. So you can now leave the right side button and now you have successfully forcefully restarted your iPhone. Now this forceful restart of iPhone will fix the issue. Now if you are getting this issue from time to time, so uh, let's try to fix this uh, issue. What you can do, you can, you know, disable the uh, home screen search altogether. Okay, so what you have to do, you have to go to settings and now you have to find home screen tap on it okay and now in the home screen just disable this option of search show on home screen now this is one of the option now the second option is what you can do you can free up some storage space so you just go to settings and now go to uh, tap on your name okay sorry now go to general and now go to iphone storage and if your iphone storage is almost full then what you can do you can delete those photos large videos and things like that or delete some not so useful apps from phone to save some storage this is also one of the fix if this also does not fix the issue what you can do you can just go to settings again now go to general now go to software update and if there is any software update for your phone try to download and install it and then restart your phone and your problem will be fixed if all these issues fail then what you can do you can just go to settings just go to general and this time go to transfer reset iphone and tap on reset and finally tap on reset all settings and after that try again and your problem will be fixed that's it guys please do like the video to support us and thanks for watching the geek page